please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Certainly. Using variable values for shell commands in Python can be accomplished using the subprocess module. This tutorial will guide you through the process with code examples. The subprocess module in Python allows you to spawn new processes, connect to their input slash output slash error pipes, and obtain their return codes. Import it at the beginning of your Python script. Create variables to store the values you want to use in your shell command. For example, build the shell command using the variables within the command string. You can use the format method or f strings in Python 3.6 and above to insert variable values into the command. In this example, the command copies the file specified by file underscore name to the output underscore dir directory. Execute the constructed shell command using the subprocess.run function. The check equals true parameter raises a called process error if the command returns a non-zero exit code, allowing you to handle errors gracefully. Replace the example command with the one you need for your specific task. Security consideration, be cautious when constructing shell commands with user inputs to avoid shell injection vulnerabilities. Ensure that user inputs are properly sanitized or use safer alternatives like subprocess.run, command, arg1, arg2, with a list of arguments. Platform independence, some commands may be platform dependent. Ensure that your commands are compatible with the target operating system. Now you know how to use variable values for shell commands in Python. This approach provides flexibility and allows you to dynamically generate commands based on your program's logic. ChatGPT